Hi Aquarius, welcome to your weekly forecast. Now this is for March 24th until March 30th. Let's take a look what's going to be coming your way. Mm, that actually flipped out. Okay, let's just put it here as the first card. Oh, well, the fire sign that will be breaking your heart. Hmm, I feel like this is one of the uh, few close people around you, or this is the father of your child that's been hanging around too much around with their friends, and I feel like there will be a grave discovery that you will be verifying this week or that will be resurfacing mm -mm -mm -mm. well it seems like this person has been lying to you for like a long period of time but you're just ignoring the fact that they are but right now this week there will be some truth that will be revealed so you just need to be a little bit prepared okay and don't be in denial because it's not really going to help you at all now this week you will be like finding an evidence about your long hunch about or about a hunch that you've been feeling and having an inkling for you know for like several months already while this person has been lying right in front of you or, or you know uh, in your face the evidences against them will be like coming out just like that and very easy and I feel like this is, you know, the reason why you will be moving away, cutting it off, walking it off, you know. And I feel like, you know, the first instinct that you will be um, feeling is that it's time for you to really end it, walk away, divorce, file for a divorce, go, uh, you know, like break up or, you know, go for a separation and stuff like that. But then a part of you, right before you will be packing your things, you will be thinking of another way and how to get back into this person. Now there is like an asset or there's like a property that the two of you will be fighting or that will be or that needs to be divided. And this is where you will be like um like opting for a like a revenge or it's like you will be thinking of a scheme on how to give a lot of difficulties and gain what you can get from this person since that they have lied upon your face for like a long period of time that while you are doing anything and everything to survive your life and to survive your marriage your your relationship and your in your domestic life or a domestic relationship this person is just like taking too much of their time and you know um, nothing ever matters but themselves only so you will be successful in you know with whatever it is that you will be planning especially if it has something to do with uh, taking the house or taking over the house and I feel like you will you know um, I feel like you will receive a correspondence, text message, email, voicemail, or like a call from another fire sign, which is, I feel like this is the person that your partner has been conniving with, or, you know, having an affair with. And it seems like this person will have the nerve to, you know, to... Um, to demand much from you especially when it comes to finances because um, you know this person that is having an affair with your with your partner with your spouse um, I feel like they're only after the money so what they wanted to happen is to secure their own interest and everything else will be coming out in the surface because this person's real color because they're only they're the one who's also pretending that they're in love with your spouse but unfortunately they're only after something okay e either it's a money help job uh, support you know whatever it is that they are only after what they can benefit from your spouse and your spouse is just like you know uh, stupid enough to believe that this 
fire sign woman or fire sign person is also in love with them. So, I feel like that's karma begets karma. Until that there is, there are actually two things. An old co-worker will be phoning you or will be calling you. And somebody from the past whom you feel like you're very well connected to will be reconnecting with you or will be sending you a message and you'll be very happy because you know this is the week where you really needed somebody somebody to talk to and somebody to at least spend some time with or even ask for an advice or even just you know words of wisdom will be a very good help to you plus for those who is looking for for any other kind of job or for you know for like a new job offer this is a very good week for you to you know to start considering that or for you to start um you know going out there <coughs> passing on your your cv and um you're reviewing some of the um job offers that they will be forwarding to you because I feel like this is going to be a very beneficial week for you when it comes to your career and finances and I feel like you will also be moving out of your place or out of your house for a little while and you just want to spend some time alone to think long and hard about your future plans and what it, what will be your next step, which is it's going to help you, you know, a lot. And I also feel like you'll be coming up with a, with a final decision that this should be the end of everything. This has been your long hunch, but I feel like I feel like, um, you know, um, you're just ignoring the fact because you're not yet ready to confront the, uh, you know, the truth. And even your family has been advising you of the same, that they've been like noticing some drastic changes and you've been losing weight as well. You haven't been sleeping well and most of the time you can't really perform well in your job and with this whole thing that's going to be coming your way this will also change you and will also help you you know to recover and get back to your old self or to at least become a stronger version of you okay and I feel like this person is, you know, your spouse is only waiting for you to make a decision so that they can make an exit. But right before that happens, there are some sort of things that the two of you have to divide and have to, you know, um, have to deal with, you know, um, during your negotiation. And this is where you will be um, getting back or... You also want to get back at this person for whatever they have done to you. And that is also for breaking your heart. You just need to, you know, hold on tight there because right after this whole thing, you will try to pull that you, you will try to pull up your strength. You will try to gather all of your energy. But at the end of the day, right after, you know, facing each other with your lawyers you will be breaking down in tears, which is very normal, you know, for those who's been going through some separation and uh, right after putting up with all the bullshits that your partner have put you through. There's nothing wrong if you will, you know, if you will just cry it off and uh, just to let it off your chest. If it will help, do it. All right. But even if that's the case, your finances and your career will be very, very good this week. So at least that there is something, f you know, that, that there are something that you can look forward to. All right. Anyway, that's it for you for this week, Aquarius. And if, if you want to talk to me live on the phone or live in the calls, just go and visit me at my website at sophieangel.net. Blessings to you.